Hey guys, it's Ashleen. Um, I've just finished doing a one brand tutorial on this look. Um, the brand that I used was Unique. It is an online only brand, but I will leave a link to where you can get it via Facebook um, if you're interested. Obviously, there's no pressure. I just wanted to show you guys what you can do using one brand of makeup. Um, other than that, enjoy the video and I'll see you next time. We're just going to get straight into it. Um, so this foundation is really good because if you use the brush that it goes with, um, you just it's in a dropper form. And all you do is just drop it straight on, dab it around, and buff it in. And same thing again until you get the coverage you want. It's buildable. And it's easy to put on. And you don't get makeup all over your hands. So it's perfect for busy mums running out the door to drop kids off to school and then race off to work or you know whatever else it is that you do in the mornings. Going to set it using the same brush. I'm going to use a bronzer. blush. All the names and everything will be listed in the description bar down below. So I'm using three and my favourite is two. You can tell it gets used the most. Three and two. I'm using Determined as my transition colour. I'm using Honourable, which has a bit of foundation on it, as the lid colour, excuse me. And then I'm going to use Smitten as the highlight on my brow bone. Just a big fluffy brush. I'm not going to tell you what I'm doing. I'm going to go back and forth and I'll speed it up as well so it's easier for you guys. Now I'm fairly happy with that so I'm just going to get a different brush and I'm going to pack Honourable on my lid. Right, I'm going to get another separate little brush with Smitten. The Moodstruck Precision Pencil, this one is in the colour Presumptuous, it's like a greeny kind of colour. We're just going to run this along the lash line, the lower lash line. Get yourself a small smudge brush. Now, my um, unique mascara I haven't used for ages because I tried to save it for good and then I didn't go out and then it dried out. So, my advice is if you get a nice mascara, don't save it for good, just use it because otherwise it'll run out and it'll go dry. So because I'm not using um, unique eyebrows or mascara, I'll do them off of camera and I'll be right back. So eyebrows and mascara is done. I'll have them listed in the description bar in case you're interested. The last thing that we need to do, and now 
I have explained in previous videos, my lips are really dry because of the medication that I'm on. So I'm just going to line them and fill them in with the colour and then pop a clear gloss over the top, like a moisturising gloss. So the colour I've chosen is Pouty. Alright, so that's the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you next time.